Aww, animals. Two-headed porpoise found. A group of Dutch fishermen discovered the first two-headed porpoise on record last month when they accidentally caught the animal while fishing in the North Sea. The bizarre animal was plucked from the ocean on May 30th, near Hook van Holland, and is the first known case of conjoined twin porpoises. Not sure if keeping the animal would be legal, the fishermen took a few snaps of the dead creature before throwing it back into the ocean. Scientists are now hoping to learn more about partial twinning in marine life through the photographs taken of that specimen. Experts have already confirmed the newborn male porpoise died shortly after birth because the tail, which allows them to swim, had not stiffened. They also pointed out the porpoise's heads had small hairs on the upper lips, which should have fallen out shortly after its birth. The body also still had its umbilical opening. The two-headed porpoise is the 10th recorded example of conjoined twins found among cetaceans. Irvin Campagne of the Erasmus MC University Medical Center in Rotterdam noted that even normal twins are rare among whales and dolphins. The two-headed porpoise, he says, is a result of two separate embryos fusing together or a zygote having partially split. However, scientists have yet to gain a full understanding of these animals. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Guess what, folks? We got more two-headed animal stories to show ya. Yay! Double yay! Mysterious two-headed sharks surfacing all over the world. Apparently, two heads are all the rage these days in the shark community. Cases of fetuses with dicephaly, the condition of having two heads, have been reported off the California coast and near Australia. More recently, scientists from Spain discovered the embryo of a two-headed Atlantic sawtail cat shark, a threatened species found in the western Mediterranean. The research team's findings were published in the Journal of Fish Biology. In 2013, fishermen working off the Florida Keys caught a pregnant bull shark, and when they cut her open, they were stunned to find two unborn offspring, one of whom was a mutant. It was the first two-headed bull shark on record. Most cases of the two-headed sharks are conceived by blue sharks, as they can have up to 50 babies at one time. Scientists aren't exactly sure what's causing the bizarre birth defects, but theorize overfishing in some regions could be shrinking the gene pools, leading to such physical abnormalities. As you may expect, human pollution of the oceans may also play a role in these mutations. Shark researchers say most of these misfit creatures don't survive long after birth, and that's if they defy the odds and even make it out of the womb. But who knows? In the deep, dark depths of the ocean, there just may be a two-headed monster who hasn't bothered to show himself yet. The next step in evolution, maybe? The Jaws film franchise is probably due for a reboot any day now. Two-headed piglet rears its freaky head. Two heads are definitely better than one for a pig farmer in China's Sichuan province. Farmer Zhong Guoyang says one of his sows has given birth to a freak pig, which has got locals flocking to his farm. The piglet was born on June 5th with two snouts and three eyes. Zhong said he usually feeds his pigs ragweed and didn't give the pregnant sow anything else. So far, the farmer's been offered about $300 for the piglet, but he said he turned the cash down because his son wanted to keep it. Two-headed pigs aren't uncommon in China. Last August, a two-headed piglet was found abandoned outside a Buddhist temple in Tianjin. It had two heads and three ears and was able to eat from both mouths. Two months earlier, another two-headed pig was born in Chongqing but died three days later. Hmm, maybe it's something in the water? Zoo adopts two-headed cobra hatched in China. A two-headed baby cobra was discovered by a snake breeder among his hissing brood on August 7th. The snake was then adopted by Nanning Zoo in Guangxi Province, China. They named it Naja. According to Chinese media, the snake measured around 20 centimeters and weighed 50 grams. Zookeeper Li Kachi said this was his first time seeing a two-headed cobra. This rare mutation, known as polycephaly, has long been documented in animals. Polycephaly also occurs in humans, though we call the condition conjoined twins. The cobras have separate hearts, lungs, and brains. However, they share the same digestive tract and reproductive system. It is not known whether the snake is male or female. The cobra slithers in an odd way, and the two heads constantly bite and bump into each other. Lee said that the cobra has been with them for 10 days now, but it refuses to eat or drink anything on its own. The zoo is asking experts all over the world for advice on how to care for a two-headed cobra. 
So for now, zookeepers are feeding the cobra using a plastic syringe filled with chicken eggs to ensure that it gets nourished. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Double-headed kitty born in China. Aww, so cute. Xiao Wei from Shenyang in the Chinese province of Liaoning got quite the surprise recently after his cat gave birth to a litter of kittens, including one with two heads. According to the state-controlled People's Daily newspaper, the little guy has three eyes and two mouths. Apparently, there's a one in a million chance of mutations like this occurring, and it could be due to radiation, infection, or a reaction to medicine. Xiao reportedly called the cat Akumaru from the popular Naruto anime series. FYI, Akumaru is actually a freaking dog, but live and let live, as they say. Xiao says that he'll never sell Akumaru, adding that he hopes the cat grows up healthy.